Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, make sure you guys scroll down and hit that subscribe button. If you guys are not new, then welcome back. Make sure you check out my social media because if you don't have me on my social media, then what are you doing with your life? You're doing nothing, obviously, okay? As y'all can see by the title, today's video is going to be a reaction video, which I haven't done in a little minute, but... I've been looking, so this video was supposed to be done like in 2021. I was gonna leave 2021 in 2021, but um, I really wanted to do this video and I just found it. I kept looking for it underneath like 2021 New Year's resolution, but it was under manifesting my 2021 year. So I finally found it. So I still wanna react to it because I haven't watched this video since I did it. So I do remember a couple of the things I manifested. I know I manifested like getting my car like getting a luxury car and i know i manifested getting like making a hundred thousand dollars on a shop or something like that but i can't remember everything else so we're gonna go ahead and watch this video and i just want to like kind of reflect a little bit on what i wanted back then and i really want to see if i got everything that i was wanting to get so if you guys want to see my reaction to my manifestation see if everything that i manifested came to light then keep on watching this video because i'm excited to see so let me go find it again real quick so the video is titled manifesting my 2021 goals oh my gosh i look oh my gosh all the way from last year like I look so different just from one year ago. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That's crazy. Let's go ahead and watch it. Just like looking at the beginning of the video. I'm watching it on my phone. Looking at the beginning of the video, girl, I look so different. Like I can tell I've just grown so much internally and outside. But okay, let, let me just watch it. A luxury car because I didn't want to say a Benz because I really want a Mercedes Benz, but I didn't want to limit myself because for all we know, next year I might become a millionaire and I might give me a race. We know that. <laughs> no, seriously. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is crazy. Hello, Shay Man. It's Myla Shay. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, make sure you guys scroll down and hit that subscribe button. If you guys are not new, then welcome back. Make sure you guys check out my social media. It will be on the screen right here because if you don't have me on my social media, then baby girl, what are you doing with your life? You're doing nothing. Obviously, yeah, I haven't said my full intro in like a whole month. We just had a whole month of vlogmas. Like, <laughs> comment down below if y'all miss me saying my normal intro. Okay. Anyway, so today I'm going to be bringing you guys my New Year's resolution. <laughs> I'm just smiling you know, at myself. Um, manifesting my 2021. These are my goals that I would like to reach all of them in 2021. And I will say that I have very high goals set. So these are things that I feel like I can work very, very hard to reach and achieve these goals. So these are not things I just wrote down and I'm just expecting them to fall from the sky. Because we all know that you got to work for what you want in life. So I just want to kind of let you guys know that because y'all probably going to be like, oh, sis got some big goals for 2021 but yes yes i do because you gotta believe in yourself baby and you gotta write it down on paper and have faith and work hard for the things that you want don't limit yourself and before we even get into this i kind of want to tell you guys i feel like i did kind of limit myself i feel like i just didn't jump out there as much as i should have so i set my goals for this year and i'm going to work hard to achieve them so i'm going to go ahead and put this out there so that i can know that i let other people know which is going to make me work even harder because now y'all waiting for me to reach these goals so let's go ahead and make hold on i gotta pause it real quick oh my god just listening to me talking before i even got into like telling y'all my goals it's just so crazy how much stuff happened after this video was made. Like, I posted this on January 4th, 2021. Last year was so crazy for me, man. And manifestation is nothing without having faith and working hard for the goals that you want to reach. So, <clears throat> number one, I plan to make at least $100,000 on my shop by the end of 2021. And I feel like that is very possible if I really um, put in the work, promote myself very well, and just continue to do what I'm doing because from the beginning of 2020 to the end of 2020, I feel like I did very good on my shop, especially with COVID and everything. I 
was closed for like five months. Um, so yeah, I didn't open my shop back up until June, and I feel like I did very well for the last six months of 2020. So I feel like $100,000 is a great goal to set. I really hope I surpass it, but if I hit 100000 I will be very, very happy. If I don't hit 100000 I'm still thankful, I'm still blessed, but honey, we, we, we shooting for that 100000 We gonna get there, we know, we know. And we did. <laughs> we surpassed a hundred thousand. I think on the shop. I gotta wait to get my tax returns back, but I'm estimating about a hundred and forty k, a hundred and fifty k. I know for sure I made a hundred thousand in the actual app like where i can see from credit card and debit card payments but paypal i got a lot of payments through paypal as well so that's a whole separate platform and i don't get my w2 until like february or something i think but yeah so we did reach over a hundred thousand so that's one manifestation goal that i did reach and i'm very thankful and i'm very proud of myself for that And did, and did. <laughs> oh my God! Okay, I wonder what else. I wonder what else. So yes, and did. If y'all don't know, I got me a big body band. Remember, I used to be dust. No, <laughs> so, why do you wanna buy a luxury car? Like you don't have to buy a luxury car. But Maya wants a luxury car. Maya Period. feels like she deserves a luxury car. Period. Um, and I put luxury car because I didn't want to say a Benz. Cause I, Which I ended up getting a Benz, but yeah. I really want a Mercedes Benz, but I didn't want to limit myself. Because for all we know, next year I might become a millionaire and I might get me a Rafe. We don't know. We don't know. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I didn't want to limit myself, so I just put by my first luxury car because who knows what might happen next year. And I'm making this video so y'all can know, do not limit yourself, okay? Don't limit yourself, don't limit baby. Don't limit yourself, okay? We're going to get a luxury car, baby. Number three, take at least three trips. So, you guys, I didn't take any trips in 2020. Did I take three trips last year? I don't think I did. I took... I think I only took two trips last year. Hey, we got we got to get that right this year. But I already got I already got like three trips booked for this year, so we're gonna make up for it because I'm going somewhere in February. Going supposed to be going somewhere in March for spring break, and supposed to be going somewhere in June, and then my birthday, and then I got another trip that I'm going in May. So we making up for traveling, okay? Um, I did take like a small little road trip, but I didn't take any actual trips where I got on the flight and did the whole nine. So I was like, you know what? I really want to take some trips this year. So I put at least three chip tr <laughs> chips. Okay. <laughs> uh, I put at least three trips because I just feel like that's a good amount. I'm um, sorry if y'all can hear my daughter in the background, but I just feel like that's a good amount. And I also feel like. Um, I work like 24 seven. I'm always working. I'm always doing something. Y'all know still I am. have my own shop. I do YouTube. I have a couple's channel and I just do a lot of stuff. I have a child, so I'm always working. So I feel like three trips, your girl deserves three trips. So yeah. we're doing it, period. For number four, I put a step completely out on faith. And I said that because like I said at the beginning of this video, I just feel like in 2020, like I did stuff, I did step out there, but I just feel like I just have to have more faith. Um, you guys know I believe in God. And also I just feel like I always kind of have this worry. I don't know if it's because I'm a Virgo. I really feel like it's because I'm a Virgo, but it's like, dang, but what if I do this and this doesn't happen, this doesn't work out. I definitely will say I feel like I have stepped more out on faith over the past year. Like in 2021, I feel like I did take more risk. I looked for more different things, you know, and I didn't really, obviously it's always going to be that thought in the back of your head like, oh my God, what if this don't work? But I feel like I definitely did try a lot more stuff that I, that I never would have tried before. Like I opened up to a lot more things than that I would have like never did so I feel like I have stepped out on faith a lot more and especially now like I incorporate that in my daily life now like period I just feel like I 
need to just release all of the worry that I be thinking about and just be like, step out on faith, invest in this, put this much money out there, you know, and I just feel like I need to step out on faith, y'all, and I feel like once I do that, which I am really working on, I will go to the next level that I need to go. Um, next, I put be fearless, and that kind of goes with step out on faith, be but fearless. just I kind of want to try out so many new things this year, you guys. I am a very, like, I don't want to say scary person, but I just always think about, like, what could happen. And that kind of, like, like I was just telling y'all about the faith thing. But I just always think about, like, what could happen. And I, I really feel like I've conquered that. So this year I'm going to work on being fearless and um, just doing things that I wouldn't normally do. So next I put make time for myself, basically, like, pamper myself. And I need to come up with a schedule to work. I, I feel like I've conquered being fearless. I feel like I've conquered uh, stepping out on faith. And I feel like I um, have been taking more time for myself. So I, right now I'm on a roll. Like everything that I manifested in 2021 is, is going through, baby. Except for that I needed one more trip, though. I needed one more trip. Who trying to fly me out? No, <laughs> let me stop playing. <laughs> but we're going to make up for them trips this year, period. But, um... Yeah, so I definitely feel like I did conquer, especially like taking care of myself more. Y'all see it. Y'all see that I take care of myself a lot more. Like, oh, girl, I was working, 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 working at this time. So, like, that whole past, like, 2021, y'all know I started focusing on, like, treating myself a lot more. I have a set day where it's nothing but my, you know, um, you guys know, like I just said, I work. Um, I do YouTube, I have my own shop and stuff, and then I also have a child, so I be tired. And I already mm -hmm. know I have a lot of moms on my channel, so y'all know, like, the feeling. I be tired, so I really need to get to where I have a set day where I just do nothing but, like, take care of myself, relax, go get a massage, get my nails done, my hair done, which y'all know, sis. Gotta keep that together. Gotta but keep that together. I mean, like, like, get a massage, get a facial, and stuff like that. Like, I need that time for myself, especially in order to make it through this next year. Because I was very tired 2020. I had days where I was just like, oh, my God, I need a break from everything. So, um, yeah. I definitely am going to work on making time for myself. I put save at least $25,000 by the end of the year. And that is a big goal for me. Like, if I can save $25,000, I will be so happy. And that, when I say save, I mean that's money that I'm not touching to for a very long time unless it's like necessary. Um, so I really hope and Leia was all in the back of this video. Close to that. Um, I'm going to work very, very hard to reach that goal. And you guys are probably like $25,000. Wow, wow, wow. I didn't even know that I said to save $25,000. Wow, 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 wow. Thank you, Jesus. 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 This one is for you guys. Make a YouTube schedule and stick with it. I put that in all caps because y'all know. Make a YouTube schedule and stick with it. Y'all know a lot of stuff happened in my life last year. I had a YouTube schedule, but I, I love y'all. That's all that matters. Y'all know I love y'all. Oh my four years, I think, of doing YouTube, I've made plenty of YouTube schedules, and I never stuck with it. But this year, I am going to really, really work on trying to stick with my schedule. If I don't stick with my schedule, y'all better read me in the comments. Y'all better be like, Maya, you better get back on your schedule. Or we gonna, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all better. Y'all better tell me what it is. Keep me in check, okay? Because I really do want to um, have a schedule so that you guys know um, exactly when I'm going to post, when to expect a video from me. Um, and it just helps with the whole algorithm and everything for YouTube as well. By the way, make sure you guys, next to the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that y'all get notified every single Make sure you guys hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button so you get notif notified every single time that I post. Period. 
because I don't even be saying that no more. But y'all be like, I haven't been seeing your videos. Hit the bell next to the notification button and click all notifications. Okay, period. <laughs> Let me stop, y'all. It's all good vibes. I just got energy right now. Um, I post so y'all can be the first to see my video. I am going to start doing post notification shoutouts. So, baby. If you want to get that, make sure y'all hit that bell. This is the last thing for this video. I was supposed to be doing kind of post notification shout outs. Guys, know what I my forgot. schedule is. So I chose Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Okay, that's the end of the video. Well, I pretty much, like, everything that I manifested basically, like, came to light. Like, it really happened, like, in real life. Like, ooh, I'm proud of myself. But manifestation is nothing without faith and works. You gotta work too, bro. You gotta work your butt off every single day. Period. You Ain't nothing just gonna drop out the sky, fall in your lap and be like, oh, we is mine. No, no, you gotta work for it, baby girl.